Oh my god, guys, look what I got. They were $15 a piece, a little pricey, but kind of worth it. Let's turn them all on. This one obviously has some issues with calibration because it's clicking. It can't calibrate properly. So that might not work. We might turn that one into a gyroscope. But I happen to also get the SCSI controller card for them so I can actually access them. I'm thinking about doing a video series called Data Archaeology, where I take each one of these hard drives and I try to get an image of the disk and I try to get all the files off of it and see what was it being used for, what kind of interesting novel files are on there, and just, yeah, just digging up old data from like 20 or more years ago. What do you guys think about that? Because see, Weird Stuff Warehouse has just a wall full of these. They have a good three or four hundred of these hard drives. They're about fifteen dollars a piece, which is a bit pricey, but to be honest, I've had such a hard time coming across these, and now that I've had to find so many of them, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go there every month and get a new one. Me and my friend went over there over lunch the other day, and we <laughs> we just spent like an hour, because I just recently found this new aisle where they had all these hard drives, and we just spent like a good hour or so just plugging in hard drives and seeing which ones didn't click, and, and the ones that didn't click we brought home. So there's probably still a good several hundred more of them there that they've ripped out of data centers and old server systems and IBM PCs and stuff like that. Just a lot of cool stuff. So I think... This might be a good new series where I do this, and then if I happen to find any hard drives that are good, I might even do something cool with them, like a bad one. I might turn to a gyroscope, and the good ones I might put on into older computers, or even, I don't know, share with other people that need hard drives. Because these hard drives, these big ones do not last. They, most of them are dead. So, if I'm lucky, one of these may actually have some workability and be able to give up some files and actually be interesting. Well, anyway, I hope to hear what you guys think about this new video series. It'll probably be one of those video series where I'll intermittently keep making videos for and kind of not really make as many videos as I'm thinking of right now. But still, it's just a another idea for a video series. Hope you guys enjoy this video, and I hope you guys enjoy this idea for a video series. See ya!